Uh, an art show at a local high school is showing off the talents of the students there. Jordan Segundo is live in Elk Grove checking out the masterpieces that they've created. Hello, Jordan. Good morning. We're outside here at El Grove. We're checking out some of the chalk art that some of the high school students are doing right now in front of us. Take a look at that beautiful fairy right there. Nice and colorful. So this is part of Art in Action. Again, it's an activity that the high school students are putting together. They're opening up the school. They're allowing some elementary students to come check them out and be inspired by some of their artwork. And they're also going to be opening up their doors later on today from 430 to 630 for friends and family to see some of their arts from different departments. They got graphic design, photography, and art as well. We've got Abby here. She is the student spokesperson. She's going to tell us a little all about today's event. So Art in Action, give us a quick rundown of it. Yeah, so Art in Action is a way for our school to reach out to the community. We get together all the arts programs, so like band, drill, theater, TDA, which is technology and digital arts, ceramics, the intro to art design, photography, all of it. We just get together for the day and show off all the work we've produced through the year. So nice. And I see you have a camera, so let me guess you're a photographer? Yes, I am. Now, so all the, the departments are opening up their doors, and we have little students here uh, visiting. Tell us about the, the visitors that we have here. Look at their shirts. First grade friends. We love that. Yeah, we have um, friends from first grade, fifth grade, sixth grade, and from Edna Beatty, and they're all coming through to look at all the programs we have because I believe they are feeder school, and it's a good way for them to see like all the work we do here and hopefully inspire them to make art for themselves. It's so fun and when we see some of the chalk art that these students are doing, so they're from uh, the art class? Uh, no, anyone can do it. Oh, this is just any, 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 any creative person can come up here and draw from the high school. I want to bring Xander, right? Come here, Xander. He loves TV. So how old are you, Xander? Um, good. You're, you're doing good? You like the art there? What's your favorite one? Uh, that one. Oh, that one right there. Look at that. We're going to talk to that artist right there. So, uh, hi, what's your name? My name's Lily. Lily, what grade are you, Lily? I'm a senior. Senior. What inspired you to, to, to create this chalk art here, and what do you like so much about art? Um, well, my mom really likes fairies and stuff like that, and she's always had, like, little fairy sculptures and books around the house and stuff like that, so I was kind of inspired by, like, something like that. And I really, I've been like drawing my whole life, you know, just kind of doodling and stuff like that. So I just thought it would be fun, like me and my friends to come and do some chalk art. So fun. I mean, what a great way for these students uh, from all ages, whether elementary or high school, to come out here and show off their creative juices. Coming up, though, we're going to be stepping into the other room and showing you some of the photography, also graphic design and ceramics as well. These students are so, so talented. If I had a chalk and I were to draw something, I probably could only draw sun and a, and a palm tree. That's what I was good at. Not like that. <laughs> so more on that coming up in the 10 o'clock hour right here on a good day. Fun stuff. Good job. Good job, you guys. Yeah, all right, Jordan, thank you. We do chalk art in our backyard. Uh -huh. I draw the same cartoon guy every single day. <laughs> Only thing I can draw. And the thing around here, normally that chalk art is kind of permanent. It stays yeah. for like months, but yeah. lately it's been washing out. Stick around. We got more in the show.